Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan and today we will discuss findings from the recently published DAPA-TAVI trial. DAPA-GLIFLOZIN reduces heart failure risk after TAVI. Key findings from the DAPA-TAVI trial. DAPA-GLIFLOZIN significantly reduced the risk of all-cause mortality or worsening heart failure by 28% in high-risk patients undergoing transcatheter aortic valve implantation. This study has been published in the recent issue of New England Journal of Medicine. The DAPA-TAVI trial, a multi-center randomized control study, enrolled 1,250 57 patients across 39 centers in Spain with mean age of 82.4 years with severe aortic stenosis and prior heart failure. The trial evaluated dapagliflozin in 10 mg once daily versus standard care initiated at or within 14 days after hospital discharge in patients undergoing TAVI. Some of the key results from the study are at one year dapagliflozin reduced the risk of death or worsening heart failure by 28% compared to standard care. Dapagliflozin reduced worsening heart failure by 37%, hospitalizations by 30 percent and urgent heart failure visits requiring IV diuretics by 54 percent compared to standard care. Dapagliflozin reduced the risk of cardiovascular death or heart failure hospitalization by 29 percent and lowered total recurrent events including cardiovascular deaths and hospitalizations by 33 percent compared to standard care. A subgroup analysis assessed the consistency of dapagliflozin's effect across patient groups with some key highlights. Patients with CV risk factors, cardiac and kidney comorbidities. Dapagliflozin reduced the risk of worsening heart failure or cardiovascular death in type 2 diabetes patients by 37% and hypertension patients by 27%. Among cardiac comorbidities, primary outcome reduced by 37% in patients with atrial fibrillation, 29% in patients with moderate to severe LVH. The benefit was consistent in CKD patients with EGFR less than 60 ml per minute per 1.73 meter square with the primary outcome reduction of 28%. These findings concluded that dapagliflozin reduced all-cause death and HF worsening within 14 days of initiation in high-risk DAVI patients with AOT. Stenosis. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for the latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.